Hello guys, Ariel here. Today I wanted to share with you a really quick tip on how you can achieve some interesting polyrhythms on your existing drum patterns and drum rack in Ableton. So right here, I already loaded up a drum rack with a pattern. Let's hear it. And that's great, but, but still it's very, very loopy. Of course, I can set up different patterns, different variations of the patterns, but still it will be very, very loopy because all the elements are going to play in the same loop. If you don't want to do that, this is what you do. Open up the chains. Let's play the pattern. So find something interesting. This sounds interesting. You right click on it. You go to extract chains. Let's close this for a second. Now what you created right here is this, the sample that we extracted, um, a channel with the sample that we extracted uh, with the same MIDI information that we had on the drum pattern right here, which is great. Let's play it. As you can see, it plays exactly the same thing because it's exactly the same information with the same channel, but with the same samples. But now if you want to make it less loopy, more interesting, we can. Let's add some elements. Let's play with the length of the loop. That's kind of cool. Let's find another element. Let's go with the snare. Extract chain once again. Let's close the chain selector over here. Do the same thing for the snare. As you can see, much less loopy, far more evolving and far more interesting. So again, if you want to set up um, interesting polyrhythms on your existing pattern and drum rack, just open up the chain, right click, extract the chain and, um, and play around with the loop length and with and uh, MIDI information on the new channel that you created. You can do a lot of interesting stuff. You can even set up uh, different grooves to those clips, although it's not so recommended because uh, when I try to do it, it sounds really, really weird, but you can go out ahead and experiment with that. Um, so that's basically it. Extract the chain and abuse the MIDI information on the new clip that was you just created. Um, um, subscribe to my channels for more future videos to come if you find this helpful. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Ariel. Bye-bye.